All right, welcome back, Appreneurs. Chris Wilson here uh, in the video series "How to Make an App Using the Green App Machine." Okay, start to finish. Okay, now uh, real quick, I want to show you something else about the Green App Machine. Now, of course, when you go ahead and sign up, you're going to register and uh, you're going to log into your back office, and then you're going to go here. Um, you may want to look at this quick video first. It, uh, that's where Dylan shows you how to make a uh, app in 12 minutes, and you literally can't do that. It actually takes them seven minutes. Okay, but anyway, you go to your dashboard. Okay, you have create uh, your app dashboard, which has all your apps. Okay, create a new app training. Okay, and I want to focus on this training real quick. Um, now. This has all the PDFs that you're going to need to start your training. Now, um, uh, you can do this a couple ways. You can start reading these first, or you can look at the videos that I made first. Uh, I guess the, the videos that I'm making now will be kind of like a quick start. But when you get a chance, you want to go ahead and read the, all of these PDFs. Okay. Me, uh, I'm kind of lazy in that regard. What I did, I converted these to audio using uh, speakcomputer.com I made all I converted all these to audio so I can listen to them actually and sometimes I can read along and as I'm listening to them but uh, you want to definitely read all of these good information in these uh, matter of fact I had, I had to learn about the iframe uh, by reading this one right here and the iframe I'm going to show you um, a little bit more about that as we go along and, and of course monetizing your apps that's where you have um, yeah, uh, add mob and uh, how to implement uh, every badge. So you definitely want to uh, read that first to implement those. Now, um, now I'm already assuming that you already have your Google Play account already open. Of course, you know it costs twenty five dollars to go ahead and do that. But uh, I'm assuming I'm not. I'm not going to cover that in this training right now. But uh, basically, you need to go ahead and set up your Google Play account because when you get this app built. You know, you need to go ahead and get it submitted, and you want to make sure that process goes smooth. Uh, it's a real fast process. Once you do it a few times, you can breeze through it. The first time it may take you, uh, you know, to submit your app to Google Play, it may take you about a couple hours. But once you get a feel of it, you know, uh, you know, you can do it real quick, zip, zam, zoom, you know, and you're done. Okay. Like I said, uh. The, the, the more apps you put up, the more the, the faster this process is going to go. And the more organized you are, the faster this process is going to go also. So I just want to make sure that I cover that to make sure that you read your, your, your training uh, as far as um, uh, setting up your apps using the green app machine. Now, uh, I, as I told you before, I'm using training from the app code 2.0 um, as far as uh, finding niches and matter of fact as far as everything but still you want to read the training manuals with the green app machine okay um, and I'm going to try and make this video sh uh, under 20 25 minutes okay so just want to touch on that real quick now next up we found our niche okay we chose a niche whether it be in video games whether it be you know Men's fashion, nail designs. Let's see what we got here. Celebrities, you know, ebooks, whatever. Let's say we already got our niche. Our next step is, and I got this lined up in my folder here. Our next step is keywords. Finding our keywords and finding out if we have a winning app and or if we have a dud. And this lets us know if we need to choose something else. Okay. Now uh, what I did, I already, I already know I'm going to make this app on. Got the keyword and everything. I already did the keyword research for it. But it's help for Candy Crush. Okay? It's help for Candy Crush. And actually, I went ahead and did a few things. But I want to show you step by step how to do these things, actually. Um, I already got my images. And... Um, got my keyword but let's see okay yeah all right so I chose I chose uh, I chose the can the candy crush niche and um, 
but before I chose that let me show you some other niches that I was considering and that I am going to make apps for real soon I found I'm in this folder here need for speed rivals that's a video game okay F I F A soccer 14 okay that's a video game too and actually I found that using app brain where it says top uh, Android searches okay that's where I found that uh, okay Nicki Minaj images that's a keyword that I found okay I'm not gonna use that though right now Xbox one games okay that's from uh, I did that from the niche niche selection portion or part uh, or video uh, Xbox one games okay that's a hot keyword now our niche is wait let me just close that out okay go back to our browser okay our niche is uh, help with Candy Crush so what I'm gonna do is open up all these tabs okay and show you exactly how I do this and I'm at to pause the video which is what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna pause the video and we'll be back shortly all right at Panors, we're in the next video in the next phase of making our apps I hope you're still with me um, I would just ask you to you know just be patient with the process um, it's, there's a lot to this um, but once you know how to do this and and you know get through get through the process of building apps and the the uh, I guess the uh, the prerequisites as far as you know niche research keyword and so forth once you get that done and once you do it a few times you know it, it, it'll roll real fast okay you can probably put up an app in about an hour you know just to, just to give you real time on how to do this but you got to go through the process uh, uh, when athletes get ready for say football season you know they have to get their body ready before they actually play the game okay so it's a lot of things and, and, and that's months of preparation actually you know so it's kind of like you know kind of like that and in a sense you know the preparation you, you got to be prepared and you got to get things done right from the beginning okay so um, like I said uh, I know when I first started doing this I'm like why do I have to listen to all this training because you know I had the uh, app 2.0 app code 2.0 train I'm like why well, I gotta list all this stuff you know I just want to build some apps well you know <laughs> it's not like that so I had to I had to go through video after video I had to go through like uh, a whole module say like I think it was like 20 video uh, no not 20 videos say I think it was like 15 videos just to find out how to do niche research first okay then got to the building process and once I got to the building process you know uh, well that's that's something that's another story but the app code used another builder okay but but uh, for this specifically we're going we're going with the uh, green app machine how to make your app with the green app machine because this this builder makes pumps them out quick and easy and so on uh, but anyway uh, we're going through the process now we're going to choose our keywords okay I have a very uh, let's just say a uh, tedious keyword research process that I use okay and um, I said this is my system okay um, this is the years of internet marketing and so forth and I came with my own system and it does very good for what I do uh, just show you a couple examples um, Few of my apps. Let's just say, um, um, let's just choose one. Call of Duty Ghosts. Okay, I did a uh, very specific. Uh, well, the keyword research I'm about to show you now that I use to get ranked high with that. This is my Justice Gods Among Us. As you see, I'm number one there out of 114 results. Okay. Uh, let's see, Call of Duty. Let's show, show you this real quick. Call of, and you can see the uh, the predictor call of duty, and we want ghosts. 
Okay. All right. Now, there are a few apps out there, well, four of mine, actually. Okay. But my thing is, I want to be within the top, I want to be on the first page, no doubt. But I actually want to be within the top five. Because let me show you why. Uh, now this is just um, this is on my desktop. I can see these these first four showing up. Now on my mobile phone, that's another thing. Okay, and I and this part of my keyword research too. I search I search a keyword term on my mobile phone because there are different results, and you know uh, uh, the uh, sites are, are are mobile optimized instead of desktop optimized, which is a big factor. Okay. Uh, say for example, uh, Call of Duty Ghost. Now I'm on my desktop right now, okay, and uh, it shows 101 results. But I'm going to search it on my phone real quick, just from the Google Play Store. Um, it's the whole store in general. Let's see, Call. I wish I could show you this, but I can't. But anyway, I'm going to tell you. It says 101 results. Okay, good. Okay, for the App Store, but it shows the first two apps on my phone. So I got to click this button that says 101 results, and it'll show me the rest of the results. And mine is number three, and I'm looking at my desktop. It's number three on my desktop, too, okay? So anyway, this is my keyword research for Call of Duty Ghosts. I did it, and I'm number three. Now, just looking at my, my description, take note of this. Put on your Call of Duty Ghost mask. Guess what? My, my, my keyword is there, right? Look at this. Call of Duty Ghosts right there. Okay, keyword is right there. Now, Call of Duty Ghosts again, and I should have put it there again, but I did. Okay, we'll have you engaged for hours and so forth. But that's my keyword right there. So I'm on my icon, on my uh, description, the first description. Okay, so that helps you rank favorably in Google's eyes. Now, real quick, I want to tell you something about this too. Key, uh, the App Store. Uh, you know, they don't like you to keyword stuff your descriptions, and I actually got a notice about that. Okay, I would show it to you, but just take my word for it. I got a notice about that, uh, and I got real nervous when I when when I when I got that notice. It said uh, something, uh, your 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 keyword stuffing your description basically. Okay, so you don't want to do that. There's a way to do it. Okay, and the way I do it, as a matter of fact, if you get a chance, you may want to look at a few of my uh, descriptions. You can see how I strategically place my keywords. But uh, computers are going slow right now. Uh, ah. Come on. Okay. But my description kind of reads like this. Um... Put on your Call of Duty Ghost Mask, so forth, get locked and loaded, such and such. Okay. Real-time Call of Duty Ghost News. Got my keyword again. Call of Duty Ghost Trailers. You see that? That's another keyword that I came across in my keyword research. Okay. Call of Duty Gameplay. Okay. That was another keyword. Call of Duty Black Ops Ghost Quotes. Okay. That's a keyword. Okay. So if you put strategically place your keywords, you know, in your description, that'll help you rank higher. Okay. All right. And uh, let's see. Call of Duty characters. Okay. All right. And Call of Duty guns. Okay. So that's how you strategically place your keywords. We're going to look at one more. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, go ahead with the keyword research. Let's just say. Um, um, Let's see if something that was hard to rank for, but I got in there anyway. Um, okay, let's say my my juicing. Well, let's say um, my quick dinner. Okay, quick dinner recipes for two. All right, let's go to the app store real quick. And uh, I found this hard to rank for, but with some optimization, I got in there. Let's see. Now, let's see. Quick. Okay. Dinner. 
to see. Like I said, the predictor, quick dinner, it's going slow right now. But quick dinner, okay, recipes. Let's see, quick dinner recipes. Now, that was that was hard ranking. I mean, it was it was it was a hard keyword to rank for. And uh, you see, 390 results. Now, part of my keyword research is I like to keep my results under. Actually, ideally, would be under 150, but this is out of uh, 390. Okay, quick dinner recipes. Okay, I'm number four here. Okay, but it wasn't at number four. It was at first it was way at the bottom, but quick dinner recipes for two. Okay. Quick the quick dinner recipes for two app provides hundreds of delicious recipes, that's a keyword, prepared in minutes. Okay. Open up the recipe, I'll choose the recipe, start and so forth. But anyway, I ranked high with that one. Okay. Um Crystal Healing. Okay, 108, okay, I'm number two right now, okay, but at first, you know, when I seen all those those apps there, I'm like, boy, it's, it's going to be hard to rank for, but like I said, that was just, the, it, that was my first app, um, and it's actually a market, you know, not too many reviews there, and, and I told you about reviews earlier, you want, you want to find someone with a lot of reviews and get in, and get in on that, that means a lot of people are downloading that app. But anyway, that's I'm ranked number two on that one. There's the keyword right there. Okay. Da, 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 da. And that's one of my first ones. But anyway, here's one that's after my eyes. Crystal healing. Crystal healing. Crystal healing. See. So you, you want you want to put some keywords early in your description. Okay. Alright, now let's go ahead and get to some keyword research. Now, <clears throat> Candy Crush. I, I decided to go with the uh, Candy Crush niche because I'm seeing TV commercials about Candy Crush all day long, you know, and although I know that that's a crowded market, I'm going with Candy Crush, okay? That's what I'm going with, okay? So um, what this is, this, this I opened up all my, all my tabs. Like I said, I think I told you it took me about five minutes, took about five minutes for all these to open up. These are still twirling okay but anyway here's a uh, here's uh, the, the first site and uh, before I do that let me show you this this is my template that I use to uh, to put all my keywords on and to start my app development okay and this is part of the process of getting, of getting set up and this with this template uh, basically it saves me a lot of time because I just plug in you know sites and keywords and uh, information where I need to on that template it's like a cookie cutter thing you know all I do is just fill in the blanks so to speak and I'll show you exactly what I mean here but um, as far as um, you know telling you how to set up your computer how to uh, make your folders and everything it took me months to set up this 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 uh, plan or this format or this template uh, but you, it doesn't have to take you that long you know get your system down it works for you this works for me but get your system down and go ahead and systematize this whole thing so you can speed through the process that's not open it up come on all right there we go okay so this is my template okay and I'll make this available to you uh, if you want it. Just uh, shoot me an email saying you want the, uh, the app format and I can send it to you. But this is mine. So I'm going to start off. My keyword is Candy Crush. Okay. So I'm going to put that up there so that I know that that's what that is. Candy Crush is my keyword. Okay. Ooh, computer's running slow. Okay. All right. Now, 
Let's take my keyword and I've got my app format template here. So this is App Store Ranking. This is one of the sites. This is how I start off. Okay. Um, let's see. We're running on 20 minutes. Let's go ahead and I tell you, we're going to go ahead and continue on. Okay. Let's go ahead and continue. See if we can get this done. So this video may run a little long, but that's okay. Very good stuff. Foundational stuff right here that you need to know. Now, as soon as you plug in your keyword, you're gonna get, you know, you're gonna get your predictors there, or you know, it's gonna, uh, pre uh, it's gonna load up some suggestions. Okay, Candy Crush. Now, what this tool does, what this tool does is show keywords for apps. Now, this is for the uh, the iStore market. In fact, let's do it like this. Look at that registered trademark there. But but uh, this the keywords that I use for the iStore app. Okay. Match, Bubble, Safari, all these. Okay. So what I do is I take these, go to my template. Uh, oh, let me take, take these off real quick. Okay. App Store Rankings. Okay. That's the name of this site. AppStoreRankings.net. That should be .net actually. Okay, and actually, <laughs> something I forgot to do. Let me copy this because that's my template. Let me copy this <laughs> and close this up. Uh, yeah, I can save it. Okay, and go to open up another notepad, which I already did, and uh, paste that information onto that. Okay. And here it is right here. I already did it. Um, I'm just going to paste the information onto this one right here. I'm going to, matter of fact, eliminate all of this. Okay. And paste my template. Okay. So now I, can, now I don't have to go with my template. I can keep my template like it is. And I can start my, uh, this, this is the first step in my app uh, building process my keywords okay so I got my template here okay all right so go to my template I'm gonna get those keywords and put them right here now, in fact I'm not I got a place for titles I'm not gonna do the titles right now uh, it's gonna take a few of these keywords I'm gonna do these for demonstration purposes well, let's put this over here okay uh, keywords. Let's see. Match. What else? Bubble. Safari. Okay. Uh, let's say crush. Okay. Now normally I would use all these, but I really don't. This is for the App Store, so I'm not going to use too much of it. But this is a good tool. You can find out what keywords are being used for a particular app in the app store okay i'm sorry not in the app store but in the itunes store okay all right titles let's see what titles that we that they suggested for us uh candy crush saga all right we know that what else okay going kind of slow here we got cheats for candy crush that would be good so let's do that one cheats for candy crush candy crush saga I think it was okay uh, let's see anything else Okay, but that tool is uh, Candy Crush, Candy Crusher. Uh, yeah, let's try that one. But see, look at all these other names just just going on the Candy Crush um, uh, keyword, Candy Dozier, Coin Saga. <laughs> see, Candy Crusher. Okay, so I'm gonna take a few of those. Candy Crusher. 
And I'm going to tell y'all, uh, I take my keyword research seriously. As one of my mentors always said, the keyword research is the tip of the spear. Okay, that's where it all starts. And as I showed you, you know, how my apps rank, you know, and they rank like that basically from doing good keyword research. See, a lot of people that put up apps, they don't know about this. They don't know about keyword research. Look at this, you know. They don't know about it. See? So that's where you get the advantage, you know, over everyone else. Some people just put up apps, you know, they don't know anything about about internet marketing okay and marketing you know of course you know with internet marketing you you got to know keyword research you got to know how to do it okay if you don't do it yourself pay somebody to do it but anyway see look at all these I'm ahead of all these okay just for that one app to, you know as it, it takes it takes me about an hour to do my keyword research but it's worth it okay and you know eventually I'm going to come down to a system where I don't have to you know spend as much time with it but right now this is what I do you got to do keyword research. It's the tip of the spear. Very important. Very important. Okay. Uh, millions of dollars at stake. Or thousands of dollars in your case, maybe. I don't know. But uh, so that's for App Crusher. Now, next, we got the uh, Windows Phone Store. Okay. Let's see what's going on with the Windows Phone Store. Candy Crush. Okay. Any suggestions? I like to get the suggestions too. Let's see, Candy Crush. My computer's running slow though. But let's see that. Let's see what we got. Go to my template. Okay, look at all these games here. Okay. Woo! Computer's running real slow. Okay, but anyway, um, those are some suggestions in the Windows Phone Store. Okay. So what I do, I go to my template. Okay. Uh, Windows Store, okay. And I usually have this in order as I got my tabs in order. So I can just go down the line, but let's see, uh, Twins Candy. Okay. So I know what that's looking like in the Windows Store. Okay. Let's go to our next one. Okay. This is a popular tool, or not a popular tool. Matter of fact, this is a secret tool. Okay. That, uh, I found out in the app code training when they did their seminar. But uh, this is top secret stuff here. Look at all these suggestions. Okay. So Candy Star. Candy Crush. Candy Crush Saga Cheats. Candy Swipe. Candy Blitz. Okay. All these are Androids. Okay. So those are the top ones. So let's get these. Uh, let's see. Candy Crush, C R U S H. Let's try that. And I do apologize, my computer is running slow because I got a lot of stuff going on. Let's see if that other video is finished on sixty percent. But Candy Crush, okay. Candy Crush Saga sounds. Look at that. Sounds, tips, and cheats. So I'm going to use those. Uh, that's uh, XYO.net. I need to put that. I don't have that up here, do I? No, I don't. Okay. Let's try this. Let's make a place for it. Um, XYO.net. Okay. I got Candy Crush. Uh, what was it? Candy Crush Saga Cheats and Cheats Guide. Okay, Candy Crush. Candy Crush Saga Cheats. Candy Crush Saga Guide. Okay. Let's see what else we got here. Candy Crush tips. Candy Crush sounds. Look at that. So that's something. Can't, uh, I'm sorry. I already got that. I can just paste that. Candy Crush sounds. Right? Okay. 
and let's go tips and cheats. Tips and cheats. Okay. And that's for the Android market. Now look at this. So let's search it. Now all of those I got just from the, the keyword suggestions. But look at this. Okay. And these are the games. And these are the titles. Okay. So you want to get those titles. Okay. Um, that's good to look at. Now, I need to hurry up and get to the App Store, actually, and do this. Um, let's see. What's this right here? No. Okay. Let me go to the App Store real quick. Because it's something I want to show you all. Candy. Okay. Now look at this. These are suggestions. Okay. Candy Crush, Candy Crush Saga, free. D. Y. Candy. Crush. Okay. Candy Crush. Let's just try Candy Crush Saga. Okay. And I already know we're going to have thousands of apps. Now, this is what I discovered yesterday as I was choosing this niche. Okay, this second one right here, 386. Uh, it's got three and a half stars. Now, watch this. And guess what this is, y'all? This is the green app machine format. This right here. So. You know, this tells me they use the green app machine for this. But guess what? I can make a better app than that. I got, matter of fact, I downloaded it. I went over it. I can make one better than this because I can add more stuff and I can add stuff that other, other, uh, that, that this app doesn't have. Okay? So, keep, just make a mental note of that. He's getting a lot of, uh, he or she's getting a lot of downloads. Okay? 500,000, you know, 100,000 to 500,000, and they're going up. But I can make an app better than that. Okay? So guess what? That's good news. That's good news. I already know the format that they're using. They're using the green app machine. Okay? But I can add more stuff and I can make mine better than that. That's what you want to do. Okay? So, just just a middle note on that. Okay? And the, na and the name, Candy Crush Saga Cheats Guide. Okay? Candy Crush Saga Cheats. Candy Blitz, okay. All right. So you want to get in? You want your app to get in front of all of this, okay? So let me get a few of these. I like to get the top five, um, which I already have actually. Bubble Candy Crush. But look at that. Got the keyword in there. Bubble Candy. Okay. Just want to put that down. Let's see. Google Play Store. Yeah, right here. Okay. Okay. Now, I also take the suggestions from the Google Play Store. See, just like here, Candy Crush Saga Free. Okay. And we'll see that is. I already know it's going to be like a thousand or more, and the same ones up there. See. So uh, basically, that's it. Okay. I'm not going to add any more. I'm going to try and help and get through this so uh, anyway we have 33 minutes into this video so I'm going to go ahead and pause this I'm going to go ahead and stop this video then uh, I'm going to see you for the second part of the of the keyword research portion of the training okay